Welcome to Flutter Teacher. Placing a list view inside a column is a common UI requirement. Doing so leads to unbounded height or width error. In this video, I'm going to explain two Flutter recommended ways of placing a list view inside a column. So without wasting time, let's get started. Let's see the first way. In this UI, inside the column, image is the first children and below this, we have this vertical list view. We have code to create this UI, but as list view is directly placed inside the column, Flutter gives unbounded height error. The most recommended way for this situation is to wrap a list view inside the expanded or flexible widget. Now you can see use of expanded widget has solved a problem and we have got this vertical list view below this image and it's working fine. Now let's see the second situation where we have this horizontal list view below the image inside a column. Let's modify this list view as the horizontal one. Here the expanded or flexible occupies entire remaining height on the screen and that's why we're getting this list view occupying the entire remaining height on the screen. Now to achieve our desired result, list view has to be placed inside the size box with specified width and height. And here we go, you can see we have this horizontal list view. If you wish a background color or decoration for your list view, consider using a container over the size box. Most of the tutorials suggest to use the shrink wrap true inside the list view for placing it inside the column. And in this situation, it's going to work. This is because we only have the number of elements that can fit inside the current screen size. But as the number of elements increases, for example, let me change it to, to say 20. And when I save the code, you can see Flutter gives us the overflow error. And this shrink wrap is not going to work for this situation. That's it for this video. If you really found this video helpful and knowledgeable, don't forget to like, share, subscribe and hit the bell notification button to get my latest videos.